Hi everyone and welcome to Triple M Adventures with Bill. This video is a review of a watt power meter, amp meter, which I use on my fixed wings planes. This helps you work out the combination of motor and prop size to make sure that you're not overstressing your ESE. Now this one, it it's not, doesn't have a brand name, but I will go through it. I'm going to put it onto a plane and show you how it works. It can also measure, let me get the instructions. I've only ever used it for testing the amp that are being drawn, but it can be used for, so load testing, which is what I use it for, then battery charging to check your battery is being charged, but my, my charge already has that facility. It can discharge batteries and it can test receiver and servos, but I've never used it for that. The main reason I use it is for testing the amps that I'm drawing from an ESC to make sure that I'm not overstressing it. So let's go to the plane and I'll show you it in operation. All we need to do is plug the sort load into the battery connections to the model and then the source goes to our battery. As you can see, I've got 12.36 volts there. Now I'm gonna to have to grip hold of my plane and then we're going to, you may not be able to hear me, so I'm gonna take this to full bore, but we can see how many amps we're drawing. Now this has got a 20 amp ESC in it. So let's have a go. <laughs> Okay, there we go. You can see the voltage has dropped. It looks like it's coming back up. I think the maximum we drew was 16 amps. Let's try again. It's about 15, 16 amps. Okay. I did check the voltage coming out of the meter to see if it read the same reading as the meter itself. So I connected a multimeter to it and there was a 0 0.07 voltage difference. Um, the multimeter said 12.13 and the watt meter said 12.07. So there was a slight difference there. And I tested it with two multimeters and it basically came out the same figures. You would, of course, when the aeroplane is on the bench, you're getting more load on the propeller because it's not moving forward. So once the plane was in the air, it would offload and drop the amp slightly. So I would say that this uh, is a perfect match for this aeroplane, that I'm not, ne no way am I going to overstress the ESC. I would recommend this watt meter because I've used it on all my planes and I've never overstressed an ESC. So it, it, is doing, it is doing the job, so it is worth getting. If you'd like to buy one, there is a link in this video description below and I would get a small commission which would help me with my channel. But I, I would recommend it and I did purchase it with my own money. Thanks for watching this video and if you enjoyed it please give it a thumbs up and if you really enjoyed it please subscribe to my channel and please share this video with your friends and if you have any comments please leave them in the comment section below I'd love to hear from you. Thanks for watching, happy flying, bye for now, bye, bye.